Hey folks, it's Matt from Pranakasha Productions, and we're going to do a test drive in the new Model 3 Highland with our wonderful salesperson, Emma. Let me give you a quick look around the car real fast. So here we go, we got new kind of headlights. That's all good. The stock wheel covers look a little bit different. back here a little bit different in the back if you open this up if it'll open notice that the tail lights now are fully connected to the hood back down otherwise it looks pretty much like our model 3 that we've grown to love and respect but also in the back we now have a screen back here and then notice the seats have tiny little holes in them and those tiny little holes come in really handy because now the seats not only do you get heated seats like the old model 3 but you also can get cooled seats which means it'll blow cool air on you which is very nice the other big difference is notice there is no stock. So now, if you want to go right, you press this button, you go right, and if you want to go left, you press that one. Yeah. Let's turn off the radio station. Okay. And then this is a bit different. Notice now the cup holder has its own little door. And then this goes like that, like before. And there's no more wood on the dash. So, that's what it's like. Okay, let's go do ter our test drive with Emma. The so, new Model 3 test drive. Street Southwest. And this is Emma, right? Yeah. Emma is our Tesla tech today. And we're learning how to use FSD on a Model 3 Highland. Alright, so what we do, instead of having the stock, you're just going to single click on the scroll button here. Okay. And single click on the right scroll. And look at magically, it's driving itself. And this is 12.3.4? Yes. Oh, yes. Look at that. Oh, and it's so human like. See that? It's so smooth. In 500 feet, turn right onto 44th Avenue West. And listen to how smooth her voice is, the computer. Does the computer have a name? No. no. Turn right Whatever onto name you want to give it. Avenue West. Okay. So it notices the stoplight here, so it's going to stop up here. It'll yep. click forward view for. Um, now it's looking traffic. around. Now, I know that the FSD on my Model 3, which is the same as this FSD, is a bit timid. It, ha it has really good manners, mm -hmm. so it likes to wait a little bit longer than I particularly would. Yeah, so it's gone a bit better, but like at this certain light, um, it waits because it sees the cars there. Right, so it could potentially do a, three, a free ride. Mm -hmm. Yep. So we're waiting for the traffic to disperse. Now it's creeping out a little bit. It's thinking, and now it's realizing, oh, we can do a free ride right now because people are doing left turns. But no, there's cars coming, so we're not going to do that. And now it's All right, there we go. And it's take the turn there we go. Me. Look at that. Smooth as silk. And now it says apply slight force <laughs> to steering wheel. So on mine, I can just roll the little... Yeah, I used to wiggle the, the steering wheel, but I learned that you can just hit the... Yeah, or you can hit a scroll wheel. Yeah. I usually just up now the max speed by one. Like, oh. Okay, here we go. Now there is a way to turn this lady off, right? The voice commands, yeah. Yeah, because on my car, I have mm -hmm. her turned off. I do in mine as well. 
You are a Tesla Model 3 owner? I am. <laughs> what year is yours? Uh, it's a 2024. 2024? Oh, you have the new one? Yeah, I do. Oh, shoot. I'm jealous. <laughs> I do. Um, See, right now this, I'm just window like, shopping. It's this exact one, just a long range. Oh, yeah. Um, ours is black interior with the gray exterior as well. Nice. Yeah. Did you get the fancier wheels? No. <laughs> just, just the stock, the stock ones. Yeah. That's okay. Yeah, it's it's doing it like a champ. Okay, so notice what she did, which is what I do. It goes 25 in a 25 zone, but, you know, nobody does that. So <laughs> there's a way where you can go like this and up the max speed mm. with the scroll wheel. So now we tell it, you know what, go 30 yeah, like a normal like, person. Back to 25. Yeah, so now we're, getting, now we're back to 25. So this is our official test drive training session or FSD training session and then I'm gonna take it so out that that way when I go on the test drive you can check off your box and you get your sure bonus you know so I you get an extra $50 for that right No. <laughs> that would be nice <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm gonna show you how it auto parks oh um, oh yeah so. well mine can auto park mm -hmm. but the thing is is like at least on mine it's like you sort of roll the dice as to whether the auto park is going to kick in or not. Like a lot of times, it won't. It won't offer that possibility. Okay. But maybe now it will with the new version. Yeah, maybe now it will. Okay. Let's see, Let's see what happens. We're gonna go like this. So now you're gonna say find so a spot. There's a spot here on the screen, and I click it. Oh. And then I can you do that stop? again? I didn't know yeah. you can do that. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, so you hit the spot, and then once you're at zero, you hit start. Oh, that's so cool. I didn't know you can do that. Back in for me. So all you have to do is press on an empty spot, and it's going to yeah, park it. Yeah, it, like, highlights all the spots that are open, and then it recognizes it. Oh, that's so start. cool. Is that new? Yeah. I did not know that. So, <laughs> so it put us in a, a car. Wave at people. So, <laughs> so you picked... Uh, uh, whatever you call it, uh, disabled spot. Yeah. And so it didn't complain. So that, we need to fix that, folks. Or, <laughs> it needs to know. I just picked an open one. Yeah. I, I don't know what they're doing right there. So I don't okay. know if on the other side. But yeah, and then it parks for me. And okay. And you're ready to switch your spot. Well, thank you very much. You're I look welcome. forward to driving it myself now. Yes, definitely. Okay. Okay, we're back. So, impressions. The suspension is much better. So it was much smoother. So that's number one. Uh, number two, I really like the screen in the back. So that's a plus. Um, the other big thing that I really liked about the car um, was that it now has not only heated seats, but also cooling seats. And so when you're in the car and you put it on cool, it'll actually blow cold air onto your body, which is really nice in the, in the summertime. So um, that was excellent. Uh, the other big feature that's different is that there's no longer a stock, so you don't uh, press the stock anymore up and down to turn left to right. So now you have some buttons. And I mean, that's okay. I mean, I, I don't know if that's a plus or not. It takes a little bit of getting used to, but it's something new. So it's something that distinguishes the car. Otherwise, it's a great car. I kind of want one now. Of course, I already have a Model 3 at 2021. So, and I really like my current one because it's all tricked out. But um, we are looking at getting another Tesla for my wife. So, anything's possible. Fantastic creations emerging spontaneously from the space of life. For the benefit of all beings everywhere, we gotta change.